name is Emilia. What's up, everybody? Here's Thiago. Today we have a video for you followers for yes. three possible axes after a tilted turn. turn. Leaders, we're gonna have a video for you as well. So just check in the channel or watch until the end or click here, click there. <laughs> I don't know exactly. So you can go <laughs> to your video as well to know possible ways to get out of tilted turns. Let's go, guys. All right, guys, as you just saw in the video that we showed before, we have three possible axes for you today. The first one we're going to show you is the explosive passive head movement. I'm going to show you once. The leader is leading us in a lateral and a tilted entrance. Now you can see I'm going to get up with my head very fast and I'm still on my left leg. So this is important for this variation. This is how I do it. Of course, you could also come up on the right leg, okay? But let's try this variation. I'm coming up on my left leg and I do a circular head movement. And here when I'm in the contraction, I come up with my head very fast, but it's still passive because my head comes up last, okay? Then I'm landing here. And most of the times I would transfer on my right leg to get out, but depending on what the leader leads. Yeah, we like to finish the tilted, uh, the tilted movements, tilted turns, mostly on this leg. So if you're turning that way on the left leg, it's harder on the beginning, I know, <laughs> but you can control it. And then if you need it, you can whoo, ground and do this <laughs> next step. I know that uh, for beginners, the most of the time you already land on that leg. And the problem is if you have to step, if you lose your balance, you have no extra nope. step, you're going to have to cross. So we advise you to... Or get your leader yes. with you. We advise you to practice tilted turns, getting out on this, like the first leg. Okay, if you go to the other side, it's going to be the opposite. But on this side, it's going to be the left leg. And then you transfer. So you are pushing the floor, coming up, and then you absorb. This energy. What helps me is to still have my other leg projected and my big toe on the floor. So in case I fastly need to transfer my weight, it's there and I have a little bit of support. But if you get better and better, you could also do other styling, for example, here, if you're uh, advanced enough to hold this. Yeah, most of the times on this case, the leader gives you that energy to come up, right? So I use, <laughs> I use my legs and my arm come with me. I try not to do only from the hand, mm -hmm. okay? I use my whole body because I'm grounded as well. And then from here, I come up with energy or without energy, and then we're gonna get there as well. All right, guys, let's go to the second option. This one is the exit into a body wave, okay? It's a little bit more smooth, more soft. I'm gonna show you once. The entrance that we practice is the same, lateral, entrance to two to turns. And now I'm gonna show you once, you will see me doing the exit mainly on my right leg this time, okay? I'm gonna show you. I come up and I body wave to the side and come up, okay? Let's analyze this a little bit. The body wave that I'm doing is a later, lateral. Sideways, <laughs> lateral, sideways. I was confused with <laughs> English words here. Uh, sideways, sideways, body wave, wow. To my right side. This is why it is mainly on my right leg. I am doing my total turn and coming up in that second. I may be still on my left leg, but I'm exiting completely transferring to my right. You see that I don't land and fall. Mm -hmm. I come up and transfer softly, okay? Yep. And then my head and my upper body, like you do in a body wave, you go completely to your right side and really make sure that you uh, respect your limit here. Only go until, you, until your limit of your foot. And then together with your head and your upper body, you come up. And now you can decide if you just want to come up and get straight or if the music allows, if the leader allows, you could also... It depends on on what we're gonna do later as well. Exactly. This, this gives a lot of possibilities to get into other head movements after the tilted turn. But also I use it if we still have like time in the music and he mm -hmm. still allows me the freedom. Yeah. I like to use it to come up and maybe another body wave or just come up softly. It yes. depends, you can use your body 
but make sure you use the complete side body wave. Use all your, um, mm, how do you call this again? So Thiago said movement amplitude. amplitude, whatever, just make your movement as big as you can. Amplitude. Okay? And if you don't have time to style or anything and he doesn't need something else, I would just come up straight, transferring my hip to be aligned again. And now I can project and see whatever he leads me out of. Yes. All right. Um, about the leading, when I do this normally, I, if I prefer dancing like this soft kind of songs, and are on the on the music at the moment we have this uh, soft moment so i just release and i give a i like to give a lot of freedom to my followers so i release and she can finish however she wants and normally i respect that when i see i let her go and finish her her movement and nice then i get leader. out or sometimes i use this a little bit more consciously so if i do this and i I tilt her on that way, so I'm gonna push, let's say I'm gonna elevate this arm and I'm tilting her that way, so maybe I can go to another wave or let's do, go again. Maybe I go that way and go to a rotisserie <laughs> return or something like this, okay? You have a lot of possibilities, both uh, leaders and followers, make sure to be very attentious on that moment because you can create a lot uh, but we need to to be very um, how we say we forgot all the English <laughs> words today very sensible to the leading Sensitive. and the following yeah? yeah last thing about this variation just to talk about the head movement itself you know that in the tilt to turn that we do right now to the left side I am tilted to my left when I go out into the wave I still do kind of a circular motion to be on my right side and then transfer to my body wave, okay? Yeah, so you go to the contraction and then you go to the wave. Yes, so now it's an active wave, right? Mm -hmm. Because you are here, you arrive all that to that part and then the, the head goes first. <laughs> Third variation and last one for this video. You saw in the video in the beginning that this one is also a soft one because I'm doing a passive head movement and this time it's not explosive. It's the same motion but smooth, okay? So also amazing if you want to use it because the music is soft and it doesn't have like an explosive boom in the music, mm -hmm. yeah? So again, not that out, to, to turn and I come up. <laughs> Gently, soft. And nice. The same idea of the first variation, right? It's just the head. Ah, yeah, sorry. Yeah. It's the same idea of the first <laughs> variation, but it's just a little bit yes. softer. So actually, I don't really change something about my footwork. I still come mostly up on my left one. And then I think I actually, me, myself, me, Emilia, mm -hmm. I do it, I come up, but I transfer in the same way, um, in the same moment, basically, on my right leg to be prepared for whatever he leads me to. Uh, but I think you could also come up on the left first completely and then transfer. Yeah. It's your decision. It's more styling, more what, what you like to do. One tip for you followers, if you in the moment are not feeling very balanced and the leader uh, leads this, pa this uh, dynamic exit, you can, if you want to say, ah, fuck that, I'm going to come <laughs> first slowly because we know how tilted turns can be uh, uh, demanding. Mm -hmm. So you can choose, just wait, let me yes. first arrive and then I get out with you. Always okay? more Chill important. Chill out, leader. Always more important than catching the music is that you are safe. Yes. If you feel like you would fall, do it soft. Nice. So All that's right. it, I think, right? That's it already. Yeah, make sure to subscribe and share this video so our our uh, uh, project can grow. Yeah. If you are liking this video, share for a Zook friend. We have all our Zook online courses as well that you can buy it. And check the other videos, it's gonna be the exits for the leaders. But mm -hmm. as you saw this video, uh, it's exits for the followers, but we are talking about leaders as well so may you may watch it and then i will say some things about followers exactly as well. <laughs> okay so see you in the next and video and last thing guys if you practice it do a video and tag yes. us so we can tag us on instagram <laughs> bye 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 bye
Uh, look, baby, um, maybe you're supposed to dance.